Hi everybody and um, welcome to the Little Kingdom. I just want to say a big thank you for your likes, comments and support. If you're new to the channel and you do like what you see, please give us a big fat thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel. Without further ado, let's get on with today's uh, Let's Play. Hi everybody and um, welcome back to today's Let's Play. Um, what I'm gonna do, I know it's dark outside, but hey, uh, don't mind. What I wanna do is, um, wanna go down to my shout out wall first before we begin with today's let's play, and then I'll take you to the area what we're gonna be uh, building up today. Look, um, let's just head down, All right then. Today's uh, shout out will be to Alex Assassin. Man. Um, I really, he, he gave me a comment today saying, he, you know, that my sound should be a little bit higher so that people can probably like to hear my voice a bit more. And that is what I'm uh, trying to do for this video, seeing if uh, the voice can come across as a little bit, you know, louder and more clearly. Like. So, uh, yeah, welcome to the uh, li Little Kingdom then, Alex Assassin. And uh, what we're going to do is, today's let's play is going to be underneath the actual castle. Um, it's in this area here, look, which is looking a lot better than it did, like, you know, when I first came onto the world. Um, but yeah, it's in this area here. This is going to be a automatic farm. So your carrots, your wheat, your potatoes, it's all going to be done in this area here. Um, but what you're going to need for today's is, see I'm only going to do mine two layers high. So you're just going to need six pistons, six repeaters, some redstone and some redstone torches. And plus a lever as well. Um... But yeah, what I've done is I've got a water source going on over there, and I've also put some water down the centre here. I think I'm just going to need one more. Um, we'll just sort that out first, and then we can get on with uh, showing you what to do with the other bits. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll get that one like that, just to fill up that little gap. That's it. And then this bit... Okay. Right, this bit... You just generally want to fill in because you don't need to see the uh, water. Because obviously that's just going to be dehydrate them and stuff. And then at the end here, you need to have two up and you put your one there. And then this, you will cover up because you ain't going to see it. Uh, we'll get the lever. And then we can do some of the redstone for it. So what you do is you put your lever here. If we just jump over the wall for a second, well, uh, you need the redstone going, then running all the way down, like that. All right, and then when you come to the end, we need to put in a redstone torch in there. No, I see we don't dig down. What am I about? Right. That is your return torch. Right. And then you get rid of that one and that one. So it makes like a little staircase type thing. And, uh, let's see. Right, so then you've got your little staircase going on. And then what we do is we'll run some redstone all the way down to the end here. And use your repeaters. Not in that gap because you ain't going to need it. Right, you put your repeaters like that. And then, now, if this is worth, I'm hoping these should go up. So, there you go. That is how it should be so far. Right. And then, what you've got to do is, on top of these, you put some sand and stuff. But, what we'll do is first, we'll just, um, we're filling this side bit. Like so. 
and if we go back to the lever for a minute, we'll have a look. Right, see, so, and now it goes up and goes back down again. Right, and then these will have sand on them. And if we just fill in these, because you will, you know, if you don't want to see the back of the, you know, of your wheat farm and stuff, then it's a good idea to, uh, to cover them up like. And then this, we're just, because your water's got to go in here, see. I've just got to make sure I've got some sand there. Uh, see if we're going to be in one of these chests or one of my chests about this. Have, have I got some sand? Yes. Oh, yeah. So, no, what we'll do is first, we'll do the sand first so you can see, like, the effect I'm trying to get. Right, so then you've got them bits like that. Right, and now these two are going to hold your water because obviously, what well, is this is eight dirt coming all the way, all the way down to here, there's eight dirt. And hopefully, when you pull the levers, water should only go to the eighth. That's the plan. Right, it should only go to the eighth one, so we'll get this tested. Right, to start off with, if we, um, we just put one bucket of water in for now and just try it. Just to make sure that the redstone is actually uh, working and stuff. Right. Now, in theory, if you pull that, it should come down and yes, ends on the eighth one. Right then. I'm quite pleased with that. Because I've, uh, I've done some of these before, but not actually on camera, I think, to like talk as you're doing it, so it's, um, it's a little bit different actually doing a redstone. Well, it's a tutorial as such, but, uh, it's not as detailed as one. The one though, this ain't my own design, this is actually one I have copied of a, uh, another YouTuber. He's, uh, FedEx Gaming, and you want to go and check out some of his stuff because, he, uh, he is fantastic. You know, I've followed many of his things, and they all do work, and, yeah, tell me, you ought to, uh, give him a shot. Because he is, he is really, really good at what, at what he does. He's really clear and, uh, precise in it all, and gives you an accurate description of what you need, and, yeah, that's pretty much, you know, he's, uh, he's really good. I've been following him now for quite a while and uh um and I've lost my pistols. I did have did I have six? That's why I had six. Um yeah, yeah I did deny you know, and I've used them. Right. So what I do is before we get on with the other level, here is gonna be your next set of pistols, which I'll go and make in a second. And then across here is going to be some more repeaters, which I'm going to have to make some more of them as well. Right. But if we just build the tower up for now, what it is on top of this, you need 12. Another torch. Right. And then, if I remember rightly, you need another block on top of that with a torch coming off the side of it and then we can run another set of redstone and uh, repeaters coming off that so let's get the redstone back out And that generally runs all the way at the back here. And then when you've got your next set of repeaters and stuff like that, we just go and make just go and make some more. Let's, um, right. Now I can't be bothered to go all the way to the top. So what we do is we'll uh, we'll get some stones mounted for the uh, repeaters and stuff. Let's, uh, Right, we'll let them do what they've got to do. So, yeah, got some more iron and got iron there. Yep. We'll just wait for this for a second. Uh, 
can I make? I think I'm going to need. Yeah, need some uh, cobblestone and so on. Got enough wood. I might just get get if I make some more wood. So now I've got enough. Um. Okay. Right. Why they're smiting them? Let's have a look for some uh, more materials. Actually, I'll have a look in there because now this storeroom's been done as well. Um. It ain't all fully kitted out yet. There's still quite a lot of work <laughs> needs to be done. As you can tell, it's just empty chests. Um, I know I've got some wood around somewhere. Where are you? Come on, let's get your wood. Um, right, that one's full of dirt. This one is full of junk and all. This one is. See, there's an awful lot of junk. Right, we're going to our dirt chests. And then we can get back to doing the uh, wheat farm, really. Right. Let's have a look at what we've got. Anything in this one? No. I don't fancy going to chopping trees down. Alright, I'll take that. Because we're going to need probably some more iron. Got loads more sand. And. Okay, we've got some wood. Oh, yes. I thought I was going to have to go and chop some trees down. But. I have been saved. Right then. Let's go and uh, get the last of the resources and we'll get this one sorted. Right then. Let's see what we can make. Camel and pistons. Let's see if we've got enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yay. And I think it's done anyway, you need for you. Um, I think it is. Let me see. You will need uh, um, yeah, stone, which now we have got. Right. Okay. Uh -huh. One. And look, I have got my stone. What did I? Ah, uh, this is not going to go into plan. Right. Let's go and get some more uh, redstone. I'm hoping I got some more. If not, it looks like it's a trip down the morning. Ah, oh, you know what, I forgot for that. Right, the more of me. Well, now I need my torches. Right. See, it always happens when you think you've got enough materials, and then you actually realise you haven't. Right. What are we doing? Okay. There we go. We've got f uh yeah, I've got three, but that ain't got enough, is it? No. Alright. Let's go back to the torches. Um, and I'm short of stone. Right. Let's go back down. Because there is still some stone smiting down here, so Let's get her for a wonder. Okay, there you go. That should now be enough to do the last one. There we go. Sorted. Then what we do is, if we, uh, we'll come off here as well, because obviously when the next set of water goes in, it's going to get a little bit on the wet side. Uh, I just thought I'd say, hang on. No, because that's meant to like. Okay, I think we've done this one. Okay, let's have a look. What I do is we'll lay the pistons down here. Then, in theory, this should now go up. Okay, sorted. And then, yeah, you watch. It's going to hit the ceiling, and a 
ain't gonna have enough space to uh, to do what I wanna do. <laughs> I was like, yep. I've planned it all, got my area sorted. Ah, it's one of them, one of them things. Let's just hope we can uh, pull this off. All right. Should do in theory because the water's going to go like. Yeah, this will be fine. Yeah, see, so because what, what I might have to do, though, is if I just take out one of them for now, so I can put the water in. And, because uh, it's a little bit tight, though, so we'll. That's it. We'll put out like that. And then, we'll, um,. So that's now just obviously needing its sand to put in. Let's get some more more dirt well no dirt there. Nerf pile up. Do the last couple of bits. Uh, I I would uh, if this is used in it I would leave yourself a little bit more space. Because you know, it is a little bit tight for space, but at the end of the day it's um going in and stuff so yeah it's pretty much right then no see so I'll have my sand back um, and then we'll do there we go and then hopefully this is not going to ruin any of the redstone because if that gets ruined I am not going to be happy because that's the worst thing as soon as your redstone gets wet, you're stuffed. Oh yeah. What we do is, well, we'll empty that in there, and then we'll fill that like that. There you go. And I theory that should have worked. <laughs> All right. Do the second one, and then we'll test it. So empty in done. All right. And then what we do is as well, we'll um so even though it was a bit tight, it has actually done what I wanted to do anyway. Instead of having to knock out some more seed in it, it was just just had to pull off a uh, a bit of a different trick, that's all. Right. No. I'm hoping, in theory, right. that does work, but you know what I forgot to do? As soft as I am. Right. We need to get rid of these. We need to, because the, you know, the idea of it is meant to be a farm, and Oh my god, I did not touch you. Come on. Let's go back. Right. That's it. So. We need some more dirt. There we go. Right then. Hopefully. Yeah, that's it. So that's that area done, that's that area done. I should be able to take out because it don't need to stick out as much as it is there. All right. Obviously, I stood that one because it has to like cover up everything. And what I do is we just add the dirt in on the second side, like so. There we go, like that. And before we uh, release it again, I'm gonna just fill in that other side. Now, there we go. Right, 
dollars. Where am I? Well, this why it's in couple so. Did I do not? I'm beginning to lose my marbles. Right there. There you go. So, if we head up here, just generally it's like, just to try and neaten the area up a little bit. And also it's got to have some um, torches. And just generally, put it, it has, this is just to light the area up. So at least then you can actually, um, right, if we take the coal from there, make some torches up, and light up the area. So what I do is just start with the bottom one. Now, you've got, you don't need that many torches, but obviously you just need to make sure that the area is all done. Where's it for that one? Oh, yeah. Let's hit that one up. There you go. It is actually looking quite nice. And now, if we pull the lever, it should fall on both sides. Right. And then, what obviously you do is you've got to um, you got to hoe the ground. You plant all your bits and pieces, and then it literally just falls down to the floor here. And um, and that is pretty much it. So I say it ain't a full tutorial on how to do it because I ain't no great redstone expert. Then, um, but yeah, just wanted to build the automatic farm into my own world, and uh, yeah, I've got to say it's, uh, it does look quite good, and I'm glad that the redstone's actually worked. Um, but if you want, obviously, a better redstone tutorial, I would go and uh, check out Redstone Gaming. Well, FedEx Gaming. He is, like I said, he's fantastic in the work he does. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it here with um with damaging my redstone. Right. What are you doing? There you go. Yeah. Right. I'm going to leave the video for here today, and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.